day viewers, welcome to Wanga Fat Wednesday where I tell you what am I not giving a fuck about today? And today I'm not giving a fuck about the fact that the Australian government has issued what they call a super suppression order about a court proceeding saying news media aren't even allowed to report on what's involved. Then it's, it's an actual thing but you're not allowed to say who's involved, who's been named. It's that. It's sensitive to national security and Australia's relations with our near neighbours. And why am I not giving a fuck about this? Well, because this is the modern world and WikiLeaks have actually released publicly the nature of the suppression order. So, all around the world, outside the state of Victoria, it's actually apparently centred here, if I understand correctly. Uh, no, but it can be published the rest of the world, but news media can't publish it here. And the government doesn't seem to realise the stupidity of that. And hey, I'll tell you what it's about. It's not like I'm a news media organisation. What's the worst thing that could happen when I tell you that it's all about... I just find it bizarre that they don't seem to understand they can't control information like that. You can even go back something that is published. Uh, one of the most respected current affairs shows in this country called Four Corners ran a story last year that was essentially the lead into this where they showed Australia's Reserve Bank, the people who make our money, one of the most important government instrumentalities in this country, uh, passed out bribes in Iraq to have plastic banknotes printed there. You see, Australia was one of the first countries to successfully distribute hard-wearing plastic banknotes. It's a difficult technology to get right, and they wanted to get deals around the world, and they wanted to get the license to print money in Iraq, and apparently it was worth paying bribes. But this current suppression order relates to the fact that it spread beyond that and now involves... <laughs> but what are they going to do? Are they going to affect my YouTube channel? Are they going to get me shut down? Are they going to stop me from telling you what's happening? No, I don't think so. Because they can't in the modern age. So this suppression order is ridiculous. And if they think that they can actually control information in this day and age, they are morons. And I don't give a fuck about them. Jokes aside, the story revolves around Australia's Reserve Bank bribing heads of state in Malaysia, Indonesia, and God knows where else. Actual bribery at the highest levels. You can imagine bribery existing. And I think the federal government is now going to get a little dose of uh, understanding the Streisand effect. I realised I just kept saying the federal government. I think that's who's doing it. I don't think it's the state government. Man, you'd think I'd research this. But I'm not a news organisation. I'm someone gossiping on YouTube. You can't stop it, guys. It's ridiculous to try.